What's up, YouTube? Welcome back. We uh, we back at it. It is Monday night. Um, I am doing some Stan Walker right now. Uh, do me a favor. If you're new to my channel, if you're not new to my channel, I haven't done Stan in a minute. Um, probably since like last December. It's been almost a year. Um, so a lot of a lot of you guys may not know who he is. He's a Kiwi. He's from New Zealand. Um, Stan's great. Stan was on the seventh season of Idol out there. Um, he. He's been through a lot in his life, from stomach cancer to losing a daughter. He's got her name written in Maori tattooed on her neck. I've done some stuff with him and uh, a backup band he likes called the Levites. Great stuff. Definitely check him out. Um, so go go support the artist. I'm not super familiar with Parson James. Uh, most of the stuff I think I've I've seen is is with the Levites, the backup band. It's also Levites is also biblical. Anyways, he's doing uh, Tennessee whiskey. Um, that y'all know that um, it originally was written by. Um, Dean Dillon and Linda Hargrove, if I'm not mistaken, back in the 70s, um, sung by country artist David Allen Coe. Um, I believe that was the first recording. It's been done quite a few times, but made famous recently, obviously by Chris Stapleton, um, who's also fantastic in his own right. Um, I haven't done much of his stuff here because it would likely get blocked or copyrighted. Speaking of which, uh, I've got that right here because with some of his stuff, I've gotten dinged by, uh, by the label here and there or a label. I'm not really sure why or, or whatever, but I didn't really fight it. But um, And to bring that up as well, I've got Patreon linked down below. Anything that doesn't go here, um, everything goes over there because there's there's no, there's no they don't censor me. I can do whatever I want to there. So regardless, um, please, if you're coming with me, thank you. Um, if you like, like, please comment down below. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Um, and definitely should go uh, do some research. Uh, listen, just listen to Stan. Stan's great. Um, I'm going to let this play through. I'm not going to talk too much. If you guys know Tennessee Whiskey, you know the words to the song. I don't need to break apart lyrics. Just, I'm just here to, uh, I haven't heard this version of it yet, but I'm here to essentially just appreciate the music and because I haven't heard Stan in a minute and I wanted to, uh, I wanted to throw it back and, uh, and go listen to some more of his stuff. So let's jump right in. So that was that was parts of James, by the way. You got Stan on the right. But you rescued me from reaching the bottom. It's good. And it brought me back from being alone. You're as smooth as Tennessee whiskey.
has a glass of brandy. Brandy, yeah. I stay strong on your love all the time. You're as smooth as Tennessee whiskey. A glass of brandy. Brandy, yeah. I stay stoned on your love all the time. Honey, I stay stoned on your love all the time. Stan, um, New Zealand fam, why have I not heard this version yet? That was great. The harmonies on those two. You got, um, you got Parson. He's got, he's got soul. He's got some soul in there. He he uh, he likes a little hot sauce on his chicken wings. He's uh, he's got some soul. Um, and Stan, when he gets into that power, that that subtle rasp that he has. Uh, really smooth, really smooth. I love this. I love this version. Um, I I haven't heard most of the other ones. I've heard, you know, obviously, this is more in my lane than than like Stapleton's version. Although I love his version. Don't don't get it twisted. He's he's fantastic. Um, I just this was just uh, it's it's a consistent smooth. Like I think it's I think it's perfect for what this song is without getting too loose on the vocals. You had very slight runs. Um, by Parson, he was he was getting he was getting he was getting into a little bit of runs, but he he kept it he kept it held in, um, and then Stan just just smooth on the vocals like always, the arrangement perfect, um, nothing overboard instrumentation. Um, you have you have soft keys, which is what you need. Um, you have you have a, a nice complimenting electric guitar. You know uh, you've got just you know one person on the strings. It just that melody perfect consistent complimentary not not getting you know crazy with riffs and stuff um and then percussion you might have like a you know a, a drum or two and then a tambourine um so it was really it was really pulled in but it was uh for what it was it was fantastic that was um uh, that was wonderful i don't know how i missed that when i was randomly doing stuff of his before or even listening to stuff of his before because uh, it's been around a while um yeah really good really good i i don't I don't have a whole lot to add to that. Obviously, I don't need to break apart the lyrics because it's well. First of all, there's not a lot to them. It's it's repetitive. You've got a, you know, you've got minimal in the verses, and then you've got your your bridge and your chorus, and then that's it repeats and repeats. Um, but it, it, you don't really need that. It's more about the the melodies. It's more about the vocals and and the harmonies together. I mean, this could be, you could play this, like as a soundtrack in a, you know, um, behind a a lonely guy sitting in an empty bar with a bartender, you know, I'm shooting the shit, or you could play this, um, first dance, um, husband and wife, you know, um, you, or just, it, it could be almost, you know, almost like a, you know, sort of love song esque just cause of how it was sung. Uh, even though it's not really, I mean, it, it kind of is, you know, you're as smooth as you're as sweet as, so it's, that's kind of, kind of is a love song, but, um, but it could be used in, in different facets is all I'm saying. But that was that was super cool. So I'm, I'm glad I, I was able to watch that. Thanks for coming with. Um, please, if you like, like, comment down below if there's other stuff you want me to do. I, I didn't forget about him. Um, I just I have a lot of stuff to do. So um, I, I try to mix in stuff that I'm like, oh, I haven't heard this guy's voice in a while. I kind of miss it. And I'll, I'll try to come back to things if I can. Um, if there's something you specifically want to request, write it down below. Or the best way to do it is go to Patreon here. Um, and I've also linked my, my Instagram below. Um, that's super quick because that'll pop up a notification on my phone. Um, there's a, an account linked directly to this that I'm doing some other stuff with. I just opened it, but because um, some people are weird about 
you know, DMing me on my personal. So I just, I created another one for specifically for this. So if you have requests directly or you want to talk about anything or make a new friend, I'm a cool guy, but anyways, cool. Um, yeah, like, like, please comment down below. Like I said, subscribe, 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 have a wonderful rest of your, your day. It might not be Saturday where you're at. Um, if you're across the globe, are, are they, I think they're 14 hour difference. I'm not sure if that's before or after. Um, if it's after, then enjoy the start to your Tuesday. If it's before, then Monday sucks. Just kidding. Y'all didn't miss out on much. We'll talk to you soon.